guys, it's Heather. Before I start this video, I just wanted to show you guys that this is my original channel. I know I don't post much on Lunar Gem anymore, and that's because I'm getting out of toys because I'm growing up. So, if you guys would like to check out my other channel, it's called Heather Carey Vlogs. And I will be putting the link in the description. Let's get started with this video. Now, I know I made a video before on my Spirit Stallion of the Simran collection, but since then I got a few more additions to my collection, and look how many views this got, which tells me you guys would love another one. So let's get started. So first off, I wanna start by saying this is my favorite childhood movie. And I know a bunch of you watching, it's your favorite too. There's a lot of people that say this is their favorite childhood movie. And it is very special because my grandma got it for me when I was little. And that's what got me into horses. So here is my DVD. And you can tell it's the really old one because it still has like the clasps to open it. I actually took the disc on vacation so it's not in here right now but I also have the Spirit Sign of the Simran soundtrack CD and I believe I got this one from Amazon and I'll open it up so you can see the CD I love that Brian Adams sings most of the songs and it also has some pictures from the movie Over here, I have the computer game, which I found at a garage sale and was very surprised. I actually downloaded this game. Here's the disc. I actually downloaded this game on my computer and somehow it disappeared off of my computer, but luckily I also have it downloaded on my laptop. So yeah, I play it on my laptop every so often when I get a chance and for some reason it won't download back on the regular computer but I'm just so glad I have the computer game. Over here is this giant spirit I can't even remember what you call these the horse ride on things that little kids ride on but of course the only reason why I got him was because he is spirit. And basically the only spirit plushie I have, which is going to lead to my next thing. But I just love, like, he looks just like spirit too and has a spirit logo. So yeah. And then over here is Rain. And isn't she from Beverly Hills Teddy Bear Co? She still has her tag even. It's a little scratched, but yeah, she's from Beverly Hills Teddy Bear Co. It says right there. Um, she has the spirit logo on her, and I just love this plushie. Like, she is super soft and adorable. And I have to tell you the story when I found her. Here is her feather. She even has her feather in her hair. Um, when I found her... Um, we were walking around at a flea market and I run up and I'm like, oh my gosh. And I'm like, I know what movie this is from. And the lady's like, she was $2 or something. And the lady's like, since you know what movie it's from, you can have her for a dollar. So I got this rain plushie for a dollar. I know I lucked out. Um, I know some of them have a magnet in their mouth, but this one does not. Um, and yeah, so she has beans. So she is kind of heavy and big. And I just love this plushie so much. I'm really hoping to find the spirit one someday. And it would have been nice if they would have made an Esperanza one too. But they didn't. Over here is my wowie horses so here is spirit from wowie 
now this is the first one of the first spirit um collectibles I've ever gotten and he has some wear but basically this is not my care I take care of my stuff I just have them sitting on the shelf and you can tell the hair is frizzy I tried the conditioner method I tried the fabric softener method and it's just full of knots and it's just I don't know do you guys know if there's any other ways to try to fix it what I really like about these guys though and I remember I paid a dollar for this one and the baby one which I'm going to show in a minute what I really like about these ones is they're very well articulated so you can move the hips and the knees um but yeah so this one's pretty special. And then here is the baby spirit from Wowie. And his knees aren't articulated like the adult spirits are. But then over here we have the Wowie Rain. And I was super excited when I found her because we were walking around at the flea market and I walk up and I'm... It was when I was still into ponies, and I was looking for ponies, and surprisingly found Wowie Rain, which is, like, she was, like, one of the ones at the top of my list of what I wanted to get for my spirit collectibles. And I re remember, I ran up there, and I'm like, she's mine, she's mine. I was, like, literally hugging her. And I was like, I don't care how much she is, I am still buying her. She only ended up being $2.00. And she's basically, like, new. Her hair is not full of knots like Spirits is. But, like, her legs don't move as good. You can hear that noise. That squeaky noise. But I'm just so glad I have Wowie Rain. The only Wowie, like, the biggest one I want of my whole collection that I don't have yet is Esperanza from Wowie. Then I have all the Wowie horses. Um, that leads to down here. This is the eagle from Wowie. And he's on a rock. And I knew exactly what movie it was from as soon as I saw him. So yeah. And then I found Little Creek, which is one of the most recent, which wasn't in my other video, is the Wowie Little Creek. And he's discolored. You can see his body's a totally different color than his face and arms. But, again, articulated in the knees. That's what I love about the Wowie figures. You can pose them however you want. And up here we have the Hasbro Rain. And I found this one on eBay quite some time ago. And she's basically like brand new. The hair's not messed up or anything. I mean it's a little frizzy right now. I just have to put it brush it back into place, but it's like not all frizzy and everything like spirits. And then when I found this one I also found this one from the same spot, and it's basically the soft version of this one, but the hair is on the opposite side. And she was also $2, in case you guys were wondering. And then up here I have my Briar Horse Spirit Collection. So here is spirit I had he was also one of my very first spirits I remember when I got him the lady at the vendor knew about the spirit collectibles and she told me that that logo means that they're from the movie and then I have the rain 
that goes with him. A little scratched, but that's what you get when you buy from flea markets sometimes. And then the storm that goes with them. The storm figure. So those three go as a collection. And then these three go as a collection. So this is running spirit. So he's basically running. And what's up with the tail? <laughs> Half of it's yellow. It's supposed to be all black. I think the paint just has some wear. You can see the stripe on his back. Very distinct. And then rain. And for some reason, ever since I got her, she had a hole in one side of her nose, one of her nostrils. I don't know what happened there. You never know what these figures has been through when you buy them from a flea market. And then I have this baby storm. And he has a hole in his nose too. What's that all about? So those three go as a collection also. And then down here, my last figures, I have the Rain and Spirit from Burger King. And Little Creek from Burger King. I do not have the Colonel. I think that's the only other one that Burger King had. And then the Rain Cake Topper. Which is actually the very first spirit collectible that I found. Or it was either this one or the Briar one. And then I found that one. And then I just collected from there. But I remember when I first got her, she had a feather sticking right there. You could see where it was. And somehow it fell off and I lost it, which I'm kind of upset about. But I guess they have a spirit cake top or two that goes with her. But yeah. So I hope you guys enjoyed my spirit selling of the Simran collection. And let me know if you guys have any other um, suggestions. Would you like, what kind of videos would you guys like to see? I'm not making many videos on this channel anymore because I'm not going to be making toy related videos anymore. I might once in a while, but not really unless they come out with, there's like three different How to Train Your Dragon toys that I really, really want, but they're not out yet. Besides that, I'm not really going to be making any more videos on this channel, but if you guys would like to see my Spirit Riding Free collection... I'll probably make that video next, but I don't really collect the spirit riding free stuff anymore because I just, I kind of ruined spirit. Like, this is the original. This is what I love. I don't want anything to do with the new version. They kind of ruined it. Just like Dragon Rescue, Dragon's Rescue Riders. What they did with How to Train Your Dragon. I just, I know it's nice for little kids, but... For us that grew up with the originals, it's completely different and we don't really like it. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Please go check out my other channel because that is where I post all the time. And I do need video suggestions for that channel. Not toy related, but like... I know some of you guys wanted an update on my beardy, which she is hiding, but I'm going to show you her real quick, but she will be on my other channel. Scooter. She is hiding in there, but she is doing very good and she's pretty big. So stay tuned on my other channel if you would like to see her. Because I'm not going to bother her right now because she's hiding. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed.